Hey guys, how's it going? Austin or Julia Piggy here. This video I have a lot from eBay. It's on the side here. You'll see that I'm kind of showing on the screen because it's kind of big packaging. But uh, yeah, it was $219 I think I came to and it was 320 grams of sterling. Uh, I saw a few things in there that I kind of like so I just went ahead and purchased it. Uh, there won't be a blue box this week because I missed out on it. I padded my cart, went, entered my information, hit check out, and nope, it wasn't there. So, uh, I'm going to cut this open here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Right, so, it's in here. Oh, yeah. oh hot dog. It's in like a big package. In the <clears throat> actually wrapped it up very nice. We got some wrapping paper here. I don't think there's anything else kind of just... Yeah, it's filling. I don't know if it is something. It's an earring. Literally, wait, hold on, is it? It's literally one earring. <laughs> uh, this guy is sterling, 925 on there. That's funny. It's probably going to be scrappers and then it'll be single earring. I don't know. Yeah, one earring. <laughs> Funny. Maybe they already sealed it and they forgot to put it in. <laughs> Alright, yeah, so that's empty. And we got these two here. This one's going off with this one. Go to that one there. <clears throat> Alright, so let's go here. I guess they rolled it up. Uh, this guy here is nice. This is a sterling. Um, what is this? It's like a, what's it called? I know exactly what it is. Um, a, a seal? Yeah, a seal bracelet, I think. This is nice. Uh, 925. And 925 right there. So that's good. This was advertised as scrapper wear, so there might be some scrap pieces in here, which I'm totally aware of. There is. I know they just got some brooches. So make sure all the stones are there. Alright, it looks to be. First one here is a onyx brooch with the marcasites. I have so many of these things and they don't sell at all. Well, they do, but it's really hard to sell them because they're so common. Uh, probably got like maybe like twelve dollars for that, fifteen bucks. This one is scrap. It's missing a marcasite right there, and it says nine two five. Let's if anybody wants, I'll just give it to you for melt price. And this one here, little marcasite onyx again. Uh, looks like silver, no marks, and all the marks are there, so that's good. We got this guy here, we got that. Alright, uh, we got some pendants in here. Oh, we got a lot, okay. Let's just dump it out. Alright, so let's just see if we got any matches. First, we got a, uh, earring here, a little marcasite. Uh, 925 there, good shape. Maybe you can find the other one. Oh, here's the other one. All right, so these are sellable. Probably $8 on these, I got. Maybe 10 Uh, This guy here, this has an 18 karat post. 18 karat, I wonder if this is a good maker. Oh, but it's missing a stone there. That's kind of, that sucks. I don't know. The post, the post is 18 karat. The earring itself is sterling. I don't know. I'm going to see if I can find the maker on it. That's the maker's mark. I can't really make it out. But, yeah. This this doesn't look like... Yeah, it might be. I'll test this. doesn't really look like silver. It's a little charm, but... Yeah. <clears throat> uh, these were probably earrings. I'm going to fix these. Put, them, put some wires on them. Sterling wires. And I will sell them probably for around $10 or so. Uh, this stuff I just sell at the flea market, nothing online, because it's not worth my time. Uh, this earring here, here's just the other one. I knew I saw both of them in the pictures. Uh, let me just make sure they are sterling, but yeah, they're nice. They have like a southwestern look to them. I don't see any marks, but they still look like silver. The posts are a different color than the, than the earring, so I don't know, I'll test them. So let me just put a test file up here. That, this. A lot of this stuff you can just tell it's silver just by looking at it. So yeah. Uh, these here, these, they look like silver, but I had an earring that just had this top part and it wasn't. So I'm gonna test these again. There's no marks in them. 
I don't think. they. Uh, no, they look like silver, though, so I don't really have a doubt why they wouldn't be. Um, if they are sterling, I'll probably ask around 20 for these because the stones are nice. <laughs> Maybe they're just glass, I don't know. Uh, a lot of it's missing stones. That really stinks. Uh, these would have been nice. I'll probably just take off these earring hooks and put those in the other things. Um, these would have been nice. They have the squash blossom style. I don't know why. That's what I'm seeing. But they have one amethyst. This one doesn't have it. So, just scrap. Uh, just 95 there. Oh, there's another one not here. That sucks. Darn it. This is such a good earring. Oh my gosh. Wait, is the other one not here? Oh, we got the other one for that one. Maybe that's a good maker. I don't know. We got a couple of single Zuni earrings. Oh, this really sucks. This would have been probably like a $40 earring if I had the other one. I'll just put these probably as, I don't know, Native American scrap lot or something. Gosh, that really stinks. I don't know. Maybe I could, if you guys have any idea, let me know what I could do with these. I don't really want to, this one in particular, because it's nice. This one says 925. Oh, that really sucks. <laughs> so we do have the other earrings to that one. To um, this one. But this one doesn't have a stone. Which kind of stinks. I don't know what I'm going to do with these. Maybe. I want to see if I can figure out the designer first. So these might be good. I'm not sure. But oh, they could just be like QVC earrings. I'll let you know what Olympic Speed is. QVC. So eh, they could be good earrings. Um, This one here looks. Oh, no, the other one here. Nice, they kind of like lockets. <clears throat> All the stones are there, so these should be like 10 bucks. A little sterling. And, yeah. Uh, is he a 925 little charm? Little, uh, what is this, a horse? Horse or a camel or something? Or another horse, or not, a donkey maybe? Mark 925 in the back. This one looks to be like a single earring. Yeah, I don't see the other one here. A little dolphins thoroughly, I think. It looks like it. No marks, but is it marked? No, it looks like it, but I'm still gonna test it. Got some little singles, broken pieces here. Let's see. That's sterling. Yep, I'm just gonna grab a bunch of these. A lot of these are just scrap. This maybe I'll fix, I don't know. Uh, leave some of these here. Single earring there. Whatever this is. Oh yeah, this is just single set scrap. It's an earring. Some of these I might just sell them. It's not, it doesn't have a loop on it. I could just add one. Got a uh, single silver earring there. Little pearl, probably not real, not worth anything. Another one of those junk things. A uh, single marcasite earring. Is this sterling? It says 925 on it. So a little CZ guy. Uh, a little shoe. It says love on it. Um, this little, um, here, let me dump that off there. This, uh, is this sterling? It looks like if I still want to test it. Little pearl, little dangle pendant. I'm going to test that. A little heart locket. This one's sellable. 925 in there. This will have to get tested. A little cat. Could be made into a pendant, but for me it's just scrap. And that earring. We got one more little bag here, and then we're off to the second one. This is a T. Oh, this is a good name. T.S. What is this? <clears throat> this is like a Native American designer. I've heard of it. TSN. What is this? Is this? I don't think this is a bolo tie. Does anybody have any idea what this is? I don't think it... I have no idea what this could be. Oops. But it's cool. Maybe it is. I don't know. <clears throat> Maybe a pendant. You put it there. I don't know. This is TSM Sterling. I think that's some Native American. Maybe like a running bear style thing. Oh my gosh. This is good. This is nice. Looks like Carolyn Pollock. Nope, it's not. It just had the right class to a Carolyn Pollock. Uh, nope, it is, I think. Yeah, Carolyn Pollock. Okay, cool. This is a little southwestern piece. 
Carolyn Pollack. Uh, this just goes right there. I think this should be like, yeah, this is good. All right, sweet. Nice little bracelet here. This should be probably around $25 to $35. So there's another piece in here. Oh wait, hold on, is this not another, what is this? Hold on. Oh, here's that other little dolphin. So we do got the other one, okay, hold on. And this guy here, it's a little staple. <laughs> um, this is a 9.25. This one we will have to test. No marks in the chain, I don't think. I've never seen anything like this. It has like a magnetic clasp, I don't know. It's probably tested though, but I'll still test it. If anything's wrong, or if anything's not legit, I'll let you guys know. Alright, so now we have... Honestly, that wasn't too bad, I think. I think I'll do okay with this lot. So, the next one... Alright, we got this one first. Feels like there's some cups in here. Which is one of the main reasons why I bought this. Two cups, or one cup. Caught my eye. This one here is broken, which it should, which it's sitting the listing. Yep. So it's missing some enameling, which really sucks, because this is such a great cuff. I don't know. Is it, can I get it fixed anywhere, maybe? I don't know, because this would have been probably like $100. Oh my gosh, this kills me just to see this. But I didn't, they did say that it was missing some of the enamel, or the inlay. I could probably sell it for like 50 or 60 or so, maybe like that. I don't know. Yeah, this little southwestern, maybe southwestern, I don't know. Looks like southwestern style Mexican, maybe, I don't know. Uh, marked sterling and a little maker's mark. Why don't show the mark on this one? This one said DJN. This is nice, it's assigned AB, looks like silver. Oh, uh, yep, nice, South southwestern. No, oh, those are my initials. But yeah, this is nice. Not bad on that. And yeah, this one here. This one actually has a Sarda look to it. Oh, there's some bit in there. Oh, there's this. This is 925. This is probably just scrap. It looks like one of those little chime things that you, that you have in elementary school. But I don't think anybody would wear this. It doesn't seem like it would be comfortable to wear. And this one, yeah, it looks like a Sarda bracelet. But this one might get listed. It has like a smoky quartz and topaz, maybe. This is a good bracelet. I don't want to spend money on a um, gem tester. There's no point, in my opinion. But yeah, I'm happy with this. Just this guy here. I hope I can fix it somehow. Get it repaired. Alright, so we got this one here. Oh, this one, I forgot. There are some stones in here. This one says 800, so we got 800 silver here. That wasn't actually advertised in it. So I still gonna say 500? That's 800. Huh, okay. I'll test that one to make sure it is. We got it in Poland. This looks like a uh, coin silver spoon. Hmm, they didn't say that there were coin silver in here or anything. I'll still test it though. This is 90. Never seen like that. Uh, this one here looks like that. Oh, this is 800 right there. That's right there. I don't, know, I don't know if they're worth much. This one says 90. I think this is, is this Hans Hansen? HH, is that Hans Hansen? I'm sure that is. Denmark, I think. I'd be wrong, but. All right, last bag here, I think. Yeah. Oh, we do have those here. I don't know where I put it, but ended up in here. Okay, so now we got a pair, not bad. Oh, this is really cool. Oh, I like this a lot. Oh, guys, look at this. It's a little carousel and it spins. That's really cool. This could be like 25, 30 bucks on eBay. This might get listed. That's cool. What's this? Colombian, I have no idea what this is. It looks like so. It doesn't have any of the copper residue on the outside. That's neat. We got this. Is Yerman? Is there one in here? Nope. That sucks. 
<laughs> uh, let me just see. Let me grab my loop. Let me run this. Yeah, just looking right there. One second. So it's 14 carat. How do you just grab something like this, actually? I can't see it. My loop is so long. So How would you scrap? I mean, I don't know. Maybe you could like, take it apart. I'm not sure. I'll have to look at this after the video. But, uh, yeah. A little single. That's kind of sucks. This is a nice earring. I don't know. Maybe I can, like, untwist it. Take off the ends. Get some cufflinks here. These are Mexican. I do horrible with cufflinks. So I don't know what to do with these. I have one smaller ones that look just like this. But, uh. These will probably just get thrown in for the flea market. All of the earrings are in like separate bags. Cause we had this one. This one I'll fix, these will sell. As you guys saw before, I had that one. Um, a little sterling heart, kind of like a four leaf clover. <clears throat> we have the other squiggly, <clears throat> excuse me. Sorry about that. Uh, we have the other one here somewhere. Here it is. So these will sell probably maybe like seven dollars or so. It's like a Mexican style. These I've, they're so common in brooches and earrings. They don't sell. So, but I don't know. Maybe I can try to sell it. What the heck is this? Over nine fifty. Okay. What is this? Oh, this is like a clip. I've never. Seen. What is what is this for? What does it go on? Maybe like a necklace pendant. Use I don't know what it is. It's nine fifty silver. It's kind of cool actually. I don't know what it does. It just goes like that. If anybody knows what these are, please let me know. L and H. I think I've heard of that. I think it's Danish, but I want to look it up again. But it might be Danish. A little earring it looks like, and it says uh, L and H sterling. We have a pair of earrings here. Uh, good shape, nice earrings. Regular common Marcus Dite and Onyx. Probably twelve dollars in those. Eight to twelve dollars. Uh, what does this say? Sorrento Sterling. Probably not worth much because it's single and it's filigree. Filigree isn't worth too much. But a little single earring. And then we actually have the other one to this one, which is this one right here. Right. So not bad. So yeah, that's it for this. Um, I think the best pieces were this, this one. If it was in better shape, I'd be really happy. I knew it was damaged when it was arriving, so I knew it was gonna look like that. Oh, this guy's nice. This is nice. Uh, the Kevin Pollack bracelet. Um, these earrings I want to look into. See what they are. Same with that hoop earring. Uh, what else? The TSM. Want to that guy up? And I think if that's it. Let's see. I mean, some of the spoons are cool too, but I'll still test them. Uh, we didn't get that other earring, so that goes right there. I'm not sure why I put that there, but yeah. So let me know what you guys think. I think I'll do okay with this. I should probably get around. 380 I think for everything maybe 450 somewhere around there so I should be able to double my money hopefully but uh yeah this is really fun to open up hopefully you guys enjoyed this uh sorry about the I haven't uploaded a video since last week I'm trying to do more but there's only so much stuff out there that you can find so yeah but uh drop a like subscribe uh yeah peace